is out to start the ninth inning. He has two saves this year. Uh, new, noisy, the shortstop, uh, Oklahoma, who had saves in each of the first two games of the series, had uh, leads the team with three saves. Oh, Guns and Roses music here. Sweet Child of Mine, pretty good song. If you're into the classic rock stuff. For the runners, first baseman, number eight, Max Carter. Max Carter now comes to the comes to the plate. Max has had a pretty good game. He's reached base four times. Uh, he's singled twice and walked his last two appearances. The singles each drove in a run. Right now, the runners looking for base runners. Oklahoma trying to wrap up, make it three wins in a row in this series. Head ten to seven. Carter bluffs a bunt, takes a strike called. J.B. Olson, solid reliever for the Sooners. Trying to wrap this game up. Swung on, Carter hits one to left field. Pretty well hit, but left fielder Haley, Hunter Haley jogs over, makes the one-hand catch for the first out. So the Sooners finally get Carter out in this game. Left-handed batting Nick Bailewald, one of the three seniors on the Roadrunners, is going to pinch hit for Cody White. Bailewald is a product of Garces High School here in Bakersfield. Cody White was one for four with two RBIs. 0-1 count. Boy, Bailewald hits a ground ball. Diving stop by Mendenhall, nice play. Throws to first and makes the play. Very, very nice play by Mendenhall over there. Diving Shortstop, to his left. Nine, taking a hit away from Vettelwald. So with two out here in the ninth, the Roadrunners are down to their final out. Ryan Grochon, it's be up to Ryan Grochon to try to keep something going. 10 to seven here, Oklahoma leads. Here's the first pitch. Fastball right down the middle for a called strike. 10 runs on 15 hits and no errors for Oklahoma. Seven runs, 11 hits, and one error for Bakersfield. Here's the next delivery. Swung on and fouled off the screen to the left. One ball, uh, no balls and two strikes. Roadrunners down to their final strike now. Olsen working very quickly. He's ready to, he's just ready to throw this thing right now. He's in the windup, here it is. Outside, one and two. I tell you what, the Sooner pitchers just, they get that ball and they are, they're ready to throw. They don't mess around. One and two count. Olsen into his windup, here it is. Swung on and just fouled away. Just barely got a piece of it to stay alive. Expecting to be about a 45 minute break between games. It's scheduled for a 345 start, but we're already after three o'clock, so we'll see what happens. Here's the next pitch. Grochon hits a line drive to right, but right there is Alex Wise, makes the catch and the ball game is over. So the first game of the doubleheader goes to the Sooners. They go three for three in the first three games of this series. That's their fifth win in a row. They are now 10, nine and one. And the Roadrunners, who are really scuffling right now, that's 11th loss in their last 12 games. They fall to five wins and 13 losses. So now there'll be a little bit of a break here as the umpires are walking off the field to get out of the sun and uh, the infield infield will get dragged and rechalked and in about a half hour, 40, about probably more like 45 minutes or so, we'll come up here and play second game of this doubleheader and the final game of the series. Oklahoma again, 10 runs on 15 hits and no errors versus Bakersfield's seven runs on 11 hits and one error.
get a box score here and give you some of the particulars. Winning pitcher in this game was Austin Hansen. He's now 4-0, the freshman pitcher for the Sooners out of the bullpen. Sergio Luna, the loser, he's 0-1. Olsen ties his teammate Noisy with his third save of the season. Time of the game was three hours and six minutes. And the 15 hit attack leading the Sooners as they won this first game 10 to seven over Bakersfield. We'll be back in about 40 minutes for game two of this doubleheader. Come back to Bakersfield.com for this one.